Diffusion of innovations is a theory that seeks to explain how, why, and at what rate, new ideas and technology spread through cultures. Everett Rogers, a professor of rural sociology, popularized the theory in 1962, in his book, Diffusion of Innovations. He said that diffusion is the process by which an innovation is communicated, among the members of a social system. According to Rogers, there are four main elements that influence the diffusion of a new idea. The innovation, which is any idea, practice, or object that is perceived as new. The communication channels, which is the means by which messages get from one individual to another. The time, required to pass through the innovation process. A social system, defined as all persons and organizations engaged in joint problem-solving, to achieve a common goal. The innovation process relies heavily on human capital. The innovation must be widely adopted in order to self-sustain. It's easy to exemplify this by looking at today's social media and the way they spread. The categories of adopters are innovators, early adopters, early majority, late majority, and laggards. The successive groups of consumers adopting the new technology is shown in blue. The market share, in yellow, show the increasing spread of the innovation, as it is adopted by more consumer groups. Another way to look at the cycle of adoption. At the beginning, Innovative organizations are selling their services and products to people who care about this particular technology, or the problem being solved. At the end, the product or service is instead used by people who don't care so much, who just want something easy, functional, available, and inexpensive. The diffusion of innovation occurs through a five-step process. Awareness the individual is simply aware the innovation exists. Interest. The individual wants more information. They begin to wonder if the innovation can help them. Evaluation. The individual mentally examines the innovation using the information gathered, trying to determine whether it will really impact their work. Trial. The individual actually tests the innovation to see if reality matches expectations. Adoption. The individual likes the innovation and adopts it. Thanks for listening to this introduction to Diffusion of Innovations. Brought to you by SlideTalk.net.